Storm Team Weather Lab. KMAC meteorologist Shelby Mack. We've had a very windy week, but going into our Friday, going to be nice and calm. But go ahead and grab your jacket this morning because it is extra cold out there. But we are going to start to see a warm up through the rest of the day and no more winds. But yesterday, those winds did pick up pretty strongly, moving into the airport at about 50 miles per hour for our top wind gust. But today, going to be nice and calm as we're already seeing winds moving at about 2 miles per hour. And little field in from the south, so this is a nice warm breeze in Abernathy, about 5 miles per hour. Peak winds closer to 8 miles per hour in Seminole. And we are going to continue to see these winds staying nice and calm through the rest of the day. Something very different than what we've seen almost all week long. Now currently, what we're seeing on the Doppler 1 radar are those clouds making their exit out of Dallas and locally seeing clear skies, which is allowed for us to stay nice and cool throughout our overnight hours. So currently, we're close to 17 degrees in our northwestern counties, 21 in Lubbock, 24 in Rawls, Spur, and Jayton, 22 in Snyder and Gale. Most of us, though, are going to start to see that warm up through the rest of the day as that sun comes up, but we are going to stay cold as you're headed out to work. Now, by lunchtime, we'll be getting into the mid to upper 40s. Very, very seasonal for this time of year as we get into the upper 50s by the heat of the day. That southwesterly breeze will continue to push in that warm air, but as we see clear skies and that sun going down, we'll still cool off tonight into the upper 30s. But overall, going to be a pretty lucky Friday as that sunshine continues. And once you're picking up the kids from school, we'll be getting into the upper 50s across the Lone Star State, and then some places in our southern region closer to Houston might be getting into the 60s. But we're all going to start to see the 60s by tomorrow as we get into the lower 60s for our Saturday afternoon, and then a 10 degree warm up across. West Texas as we get into the lower 70s by Sunday and that fire weather chance is going to return into our forecast but not for long because for the next six to ten days we are going to be staying below average for those temperatures and we could start to see some winter weather as a little bit of moisture comes into our area by the middle of next week. Now as we do so we are going to be seeing these temperatures dropping and if we do see any moisture coming through that means that we'll have snow by the middle of next week but we are still looking out for that because currently it's looking more like a wind chill concern as we return to feeling like those negative 15 and negative 5 through our Wednesday morning. But today going to be nice and mild out there. Again, grab your jacket. You can ditch it by the afternoon though and we'll continue to warm up through the rest of the week. And then by Monday, President's Day rolls around and that's going to be another windy one coming back in, Laura.